Well, look at people here tonight. My UNC family, a pleasant good night. A pleasant good night to all my colleagues. A pleasant good night to my Natex colleagues and all members of parliament and councillors. And you, the people of St. Joseph, my brothers and sisters, I want to welcome you to the constituency of St. Joseph. Well, I am here just to do a few things. Well, I am here to tell you about what really happened in St. Joseph too. You heard some, you're going to hear some more. Well, in St. Joseph, we have bad roads like that. Hole like that in the road. To the point where we have decided where every street have a pothole, we name it the Alsing Lane. We name it Convent Girl Lane. We name it everything because the Alsing must take ownership of poor representation in St. Joseph. <laughs> Another issue is affecting our, our constituency is crime. Yes, crime. Believe it or not, in this constituency, in Arangwa itself, crime has risen. But what has been doing? What is this MP doing? Nothing. Nothing at all. Our Minister of National Security, we can't see him. And if you see him on TV, he's sleeping. He's bepping on himself. Like he have a case of dropsy. We don't know, we know if he come in or he go in. My brothers and sisters, one other major area that is affecting this constituency, cancer patients are on the rise my brothers and sisters. And in this constituency, right there in Mount Hope, we were building the Oncology Center, which was being continued under Kamla Passat Bissessor. Then came the Alsing. The Alsing and Rowley stopped it. The Alsing, you have left St. Joseph cancer patients to die, because there's no way to get any medication or any form of redress. But no fear, no fear. Very soon, we are saying, Call an election, because we want an election now. All you want an election? Because we want Kamala Prasad Bissessa to come back as Prime Minister in this country. We want good representation. We have a very good team led by a hard-working coordinator called Anil Roberts. And very soon, when the election is called, the UNC will take back St. Joseph. Now, my brothers and sisters, as a practicing attorney at law, I want to say, that I want to congratulate, I want to congratulate and join me in congratulating our UNC senators for standing up for the constitutional rights of our people. Imagine, they bring this bail bill. They want you to stop you from having the right to apply for bail. Now, I won't go much into it because I have colleagues here who I sure will go more into it. But what I want to tell them is that they must visit the courts. They must go and visit our little police cell. Because let me tell you something. When someone is arrested, the first thing they take away from you is your watch. So when your watch is taken away from you, you know what's happened there? A second can be deemed as a lifetime inside of there. And cells are dark. They are gloomy. They're sometimes nasty. They're even full. So they want to leave you inside of there for 120 days with no bail? No, no, no. We're not saying that cannot happen. That must not happen. So my brothers and sisters, we must thank our people for standing up, led by Kamla Prasad Bissessa. That can happen. I also listened to Mr. Nuka Sagram sing. My dear girl, you know we young people, let's say, yes, I, I think I'm still young. You for real? Are you for real? You came out in the parliament and supported that? Girl, the chambers that you came out from, a learned senior counsel who fights for people right. I don't think she'd let you come back when you lost government. You gotta go and find an next office. My brothers and sisters, I want to tell you that if this government wants to get serious, well, hear what? Open back the courts. Forget this virtual thing. Because that virtual court is virtual hell. Because sometimes people don't have internet. People can't log on. They can't even log in. You have a judge who stood up and said, virtual court is virtual hell. So open back the courts and fix the system. My friends, I will close by telling you this, that very soon, very soon, the rising sun will rise. And when it rise in St. Joseph, we will take back St. Joseph. We will beat them in St. Joseph. We will beat them in Aranguez. We will beat them in Bamboo. We will beat them everywhere because the UNC is coming and the people is calling back for the return of Kamla Basad Bissasa. I thank you. Enjoy the rest of the night. Ladies and gentlemen, long live the United National Congress. Long live Kamla Basad Bissasa. I thank you.